My booty is <laughs> burning. I may have given us one more just because I can. <sighs> wow. What's happening, Class Fit Sugar? I'm your trainer, Jenna Willis. We have a 30 minute hardest hit workout today. I'm already holding these pop sugar dumbbells, so be sure to grab a set light enough to curl and heavy enough to deadlift. Let's get rocking. Do it. <laughs> Woo, I don't know about you all, but I am really excited to already dive in. So let's go ahead and start off in that nice high lunge, facing that first wall, opening up them hips. It's all in the hips, baby, at least right now. It is opening up those hip flexors, reaching up high to the sky. Nice big inhale through the nose. Oh, exhale it all out. I always like to say this is a great time to set your intention for what the workout is. And wherever you're at, whatever you do, first of all, open up into that warrior too. But also, pick where you're at right now, right? Maybe it's just signing on to this workout today. Maybe it's digging a little bit deeper. Maybe it's grabbing some heavier weights than you did the last workout. But whatever you do, you do you. Go ahead, open up that arm all the way. Oh, that feels so so it good right now. So Doesn't that feel so yeah. good? You're just like, we could just stay here the whole the whole time. The yeah, whole let's time. Do Please. That. Yeah. Can we do that? <laughs> <laughs> Beautiful. Open it all the way up. Good. Right from here, we're gonna do what I like to say, a swoop and scoop. So we're gonna swoop that arm all the way through and hit it on the other side. Nice high lunge over here. Good, the more that you shift into that, the more that you really are gonna open up those hips. And this side feels different. Does, yeah, so I like to say we're like perfectly imbalanced, which means the sides are gonna feel different, which is totally normal, by the way. Just listen to where your body's at today. Open it up into that warrior two. Good, I know. What I want everyone to do is just squeeze those shoulders up really quick and then relax them down. Doesn't that feel good? Amazing. All of a sudden you're like, okay, I'm a little more settled in it. We're gonna let you settle before we go a little crazy. Ooh. Go ahead, reach it all the way up and over to the other side. Again, inhale through the nose, exhale out. I always like to say this is a good time to get in tune with your breath because through this workout, you're gonna lose it a little bit, right? And I wanna remind you to use it through the workout. Let it support you and push you through. Beautiful, good. Right from here, we're gonna step it on back to the top of the mat. Good. We're gonna walk it on out just into a quick little inchworm right here. And we're gonna drive our hips back. That left hand's gonna reach back to that right foot. We're gonna hit that plank. Good. And then that right hand is gonna reach all the way back to that left foot. Good. Right here, we're alternating through. Squeeze those shoulder blades down and back. Good. And if you're if your ham hocks, that's what I like to call them, not hamstrings, your <laughs> ham hocks are feeling a little tight, go ahead and adjust it just by reaching back to her hips right now. Good. Or how Paris and I are doing, you're going all the way back to those feet. Beautiful. Good. It's when you squeeze and breathe. And when you hit that plank, really hit it. Don't quit it. Don't let those hips sag, all right? We already opened up them hips. We're now starting to engage that core a little bit. Inhale through the nose, exhale it out. Good, we're still in the warm up here. As much as you're like, are we already in the workout? I mean, yes and <laughs> we're warming it up for the workout. The body is getting toasty right now. It is. definitely is. <laughs> yeah. You guys are like, so we're done. We're done here? No, yeah. no, 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 good. We have just a few more and then we're gonna stand it on up. Good, right here, let's go ahead and walk it back. Another inchworm, walk those hands back towards your feet. Stand it up one vertebra at a time. Fun little fact, it's vertebra when oh. it's one at a time. Did y'all know that? I say vertebrae. It's vertebra. vertebra. Come on, put me on. <laughs> Good. We're just gonna go into some good old fashioned jumping jacks and overhead jacks here. Good, if you wanna slow it down a little bit, you could go ahead and step it out just like Tay is doing. But Paris and I, right here. Reach up high to the sky in between each. This is just the warm up. <laughs> <laughs> this is just where everything's getting nice and toasty for the workout, getting ready to dive in here. The more that you reach, the more that you feel. The more that you feel, the more changes happening in that body, baby. Oh yeah, I feel it in my arms already. Ooh, girl, we haven't even started using the weights yet. I'm worried. <laughs> Good. Inhale through the nose, exhale out. Slow and steady sometimes does win the race, so stick with us. And when you think you have nothing left, just dig a little bit deeper. Just a little bit. 
little bit more, but seriously, you only have about five more seconds of this before we do dive in to that first movement. Last one, and go ahead and grab one of those heavier weights. Go ahead, we're gonna put it right behind our shoulder blades here, right? Side view, you're welcome. You're gonna drive those hips back to the wall behind you, and then just go ahead and stand it all the way. We going all the way up, just like in this workout. Drive those hips back and stand it all the way up. Beautiful. Jenna, what does this work? Good, can you feel that through your glutes, your lower back, and those ham hocks, right? So the, it's really important to keep a nice strong core here while you're doing this movement. Driving those hips back, imagine there's a rope pulling you back and then stand it all the way up, good. We only got time for just about one, it's all happening so fast. Good, stand it on up, set that weight down. And we're gonna go into some good old fashioned jumping rope. So here we go. Paris and I, oh girl, she's one up in me here. Hold those weights if you want and you wanna ring them around. And if you need something a little less intense, go ahead and shift that weight side to side. We're right here. I think you just inspired me. Hold on, Jenna, you got it. It all happened so fast, I was like, I can't. Hold on here. Can you double under though? That's the question. Oh, Holding no. those weights. Oh, yes you can. I mean, it's yes you can, there it is. <laughs> I think I can, I think I can. We just became the Thomas Little Engine, right? So right here, nice little wrist circles. My forearms are getting a pump. I wasn't expecting that today. <laughs> we burn, baby, burn. My forearms are burning. It's okay. That, that's like I said, right? We showed up to get that hardest hit today and that's exactly what's happening here. Good, you were almost there in just a few seconds. Come on, give me a little bit more, a little bit more, a little bit more, okay. Hate me now, love me later, set those weights down. Congratulations. Woo! Just that's kidding, nice. don't set those weights down. Okay. I was just messing with you, Paris. Ha -ha. We're gonna go into some good old fashioned cheerleader. Why to tease? Why, because I said so. <laughs> so we're right here, nice. Y, and then T. Now, the goal for success here is you're just getting those weights up to shoulder height. Squeezing those shoulder blades down and back. Beautiful, and if the weight is feeling like it's too much, check out Tay over here. You don't have to do any weight. It's still effective. Right, it still really is. It's all in the, I like to say squeeze and breathe, right? <laughs> Instead of shake and bake here, it's squeeze and breathe. <laughs> I mean it, right? <laughs> Squeeze and breathe. Exhale on exertion. Remember that shrug that I had us do earlier? Right, it's to remind us to relax those shoulder blades. Come on, we got time for one more. Beautiful. And just like that, take those weights, rack them up at your shoulders, right? We're gonna go squat, right? Step back, squat, step back. Right here, beautiful. You all can keep facing forwards. I'm gonna give them that side view. <laughs> There it is, good. Now, the way to make this move a little more challenging, you have a few options. You could speed it up. Not a lot, baby girl, just a little bit. A little bit more, right? Or you can get that all the way down, right, to the grass. Uh, Go a bad. little bit deeper, right, What about though? heavier weight? Oh, Ooh, oh or you like could up the weight. Today. Yes, there it is. You wanna grab those heavier weights? Feel free. Oh my gosh, don't It's do a it. shoulder party. <laughs> yeah. I knew that was a mistake when you grabbed them, but I'm not, I'm, I'm here to Woo! pump it up, right? Whoa, pump it up. You got to, you got to pump it up right now. You're almost there. Stick with us. Keep those elbows locked and loaded in right by your side. You were almost there. Did somebody say absolutely time to hit some abs? Oh, because oh. we are. Okay. Don't drop those weights. Don't you do it. <laughs> so here we go. You can actually go down to one weight if you want to right at chest height, right here. And we're gonna unload that weight down and drive those knees straight up to your chest. That timer's already going. Beautiful, and if it's too much, you can hold it. And then even more so, you can put your feet down if you need to. There it is, yes, how does that feel? Even better. Lower, how does it feel? Anybody awesome powers? She's like lower, he's like, how does it feel, baby? <laughs> yeah, I remember that. Squeeze those shoulder blades down and back. Again, it's all in the core right now. I always like to say core galore because you're pretty much using your core, your spinal Ooh. support for every move that you do through exercise, believe it or not. And if you're not, check yourself on your movements because that really is the key to success with any sort of movement here. It's our support. Good. We're almost there. 
I'm already How you doing back there? I'm holding up. How you doing? Okay, good, because that's your last one, ladies and gentlemen. Set that weight down, stand it on up. So we're going here, those jumping jacks that we did before. I'm giving us a little combo platter. We're gonna go up, tap, up, tap. Good, and if you need to just step it out, you could step it out, but that timer is already going. Paris, I'm so glad you're also a dancer because you got this one, two down like, <laughs> like a champ. <laughs> it is a little <laughs> I know, it's like, it's like a little jig. You could find us in the club doing this later. You could find us that's right. Don't think about that right now. We're here, we're present, we're getting our groove on. Beautiful. Inhale through the nose. Exhale it out, those feet are facing what? Forwards. The whole time, good, reaching up all the way high to the sky. We got time for one more. Good. Woo. Oh, yeah. How are we doing? Great. Yes, are you yes. loving life right now? Love yeah. life. Me living, too. Living, loving, loving. We're gonna go into some good old fashioned deadlifts. So when I said get those heavier weights, now is the time, baby. So go ahead, yeah. grab those heavier weights. Good, we do have a row in here. So we're gonna unload that weight down for that deadlift, stand it all the way up, hinge, and hit that row. Good, all the way back up. Nice, there it is. So, this is like a fun little thing I like to say. Imagine you're at a party, and you need to use the bathroom, right? And you're in line, you're waiting to use the toilet, you gotta go real bad. You hit that toilet. <laughs> you don't wanna be the one at the party missing that toilet. That's what makes a good deadlift. Right, it's the difference between <laughs> this and that. All right, that's what makes a good dad. I'm like, let me get in the line here with everybody else. Good, we got time for one more. No chicken wings here. Keep those elbows locked and loaded in, right by our side. Beautiful. And this is when we get a little bit crazy here. Go ahead, grab those lighter weights. They're gonna go right in the middle of you. You can also get those heavier ones if you want. Mm -hmm. But we're right. <laughs> that was awesome. We're gonna lateral lunge it out. Grab those weights, explode off the mat, and hit it. Don't quit it on the other side. But guess what? That timer's going. So if you're signed on to this workout right now, you hitting it, not quitting it. Good. If you need that modification, right? You have two options here. You can either hit those lateral lunges and meet it in the middle, or Hit that lateral lunge and jump without those weights, right? If that weight's becoming a little bit too much, I know those inner thighs right now, they're loving us. I mean, maybe hating you, but like they're giving you that love. <laughs> My mind just went into like love potion number nine. I don't know how that <laughs> happened. Good, we're almost there. Last one. Oh, my booty is a burning. I may have given us one more just because I can. Wow, set those weights down, stand up, shake it off. You got baby deer legs right now. It's okay, because we're going into a glute bridge with a chest press. You can still hold those lighter weights, but if you're really digging deep today, go ahead, grab those heavier ones. Let's go ahead, meet me on the mat here. Good old fashioned glute bridge, chest press. So palms are facing our legs. We're gonna drive that weight up as the weights go down. Right, hips go down, and you can meet me in the middle. That's right, we are almost there. Drive those weights straight up to the sky. Good, and if it's too much, what I want you to do is just go ahead, hold that glute braid, right? Just beautiful, I'll tell you doing, Tay, why don't you still try to give me one chest press? Mm -hmm. There it is, <laughs> one, just one. I could do one. Okay, <laughs> we could do one. We are almost there. Beautiful, we got time for one more. Unload that weight down, grab those lighter weights, and get on up, get on up, because we're going into some overhead punches. Rack those weights right here. We gonna walk it, you walk it out, walk it out. We walk it out, walk it out, walk it out. That's right, to the beat, walk it out, walk punch it, it out. out, punch it out. Hey, <laughs> we punch it out. <laughs> Good, now, I really want you to focus on that rotation in the hips. It all goes back to the hips, baby. Them hips don't lie. Don't. <laughs> okay, in the words of Shakira. Mm -mm. Here we go. Good, if you need to slow it down a little bit, just slow down the momentum a little bit or drop those weights. Good, but you did ask for that hip workout today. So I do encourage you to push just 
A little bit harder now. A little bit faster now. Come on, we got two more. Hey, 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 hey. I just want you all to know that rest period was broken by singing. Set those weights down. Good. Hold on to one right at the chest. We got some good old fashioned Russian twists. Now, the way to intensify this move, can you drive that weight to the sky yes. in between any of these moves? Also, I'd like to call something out here. If at any point through this workout, beautiful, and if you need to set those feet yeah. down, Lost you can. My balance there. <laughs> it's like I'm already there. Yeah. Feet have been down the whole, the whole time. <laughs> They've been down. Good. If at any point through this workout, you need to hydrate or you need some water, please listen to where your body's at. These are some intense moves, right? If you're starting to sweat, right? Go ahead, treat yourself to a quick sip of water. You're almost there. Squeeze those shoulder blades down and back. Good. We got five, four, three, two, come on, two, come on. Two, come on, okay, stand it on up. Grab one of those heavier weights, right? So right here, we're doing a nice little lateral move. So we're gonna go to the right, to the right, Ooh, step favorite. it on up. To the left, to good, step it on up. Here we go. We're in this together, good. The lower you get, the more that you feel, right? Do you all notice that? And if it's too challenging, don't go quite as low. Don't you creep. <laughs> good, we're gonna drop the weight. Last one, and we're gonna go into some good old fashioned inner outers here, right? Tay, you can step it out or stay low the whole time. Here we go. Paris, yeah. come on, baby. Yeah. Give me that love. I know those legs are burning. I know you're feeling it, but stick with me here. Inhale through the nose, exhale out. You only got five more seconds to give me your all before we go Ooh. back. I know that I'm booty. Ooh. Uh, damn, Jenna. Shake it off one more time. And grab those heavier weights. Right, it's time to shine, baby. We have a sumo dead, so she said spread them. I mean it, spread them. <laughs> right here, that's what she said. Deadlift here. Can you give me that nice high pull? Good, so right here, stick that butt out, shut off. Remember that story I shared about being at that party? That's what I'm talking about. Good. This isn't a squat. So anyone who's at home right now, good. I really want you to focus on driving those hips back. Beautiful, What's feet are out 40. With no Say that, yes. So you could drop those with weights no down and still give me that nice same movement. Okay. Good, all the way down and drive those elbows straight up. Beautiful. We are almost there. Last one. Good. Set those weights down and grab a heavier, sorry, the two lighter weights. We're going right here. Reverse lunge. Give me that nice little twist. Beautiful. Alternating sides here. Good. And if it's too much, drop those weights. Good. And if you really feel like getting crazy, those arms can go straight. Ooh. You're gonna Ooh. regret that one Ooh. real quick though. <laughs> and guess what? I love some self-loathing punishment, so I'm doing it. <laughs> How's everybody else doing? Sweet. Yeah? yeah? It's good, right? Mm -hmm. That okay. shoulder burn, that stability, that twist is actually releasing toxins. Right now, I got a lot of toxins for my baby, so I need this one too. <laughs> good, almost there. Last one. Wow. <laughs> Set those weights down, pick up those heavier weights, right at chest height. Now, if you need that modification, grab those lighter ones. We're driving that weight straight up to the sky with some good old fashioned weighted jacks. Here we go. Yes, baby. <laughs> the other option is, hey, you should make me look good today. <laughs> good, almost Step there. Out. Beautiful. <laughs> The more that you drive that weight to the sky, the more that you feel that, right? So extend. So when I'm like, reach for the stars, baby. But seriously, I know you're at home right now and you're like, this is sucking quite a bit. Stick with me. Because you're so much closer to that finish line than you even know. And you signed on to get that sweat going. And that's what we're doing right here. We got three, come on. 
You got this too, come on. Stick with me. You are worth every second of this movement. Oh, Ooh, baby, that feels good. <sighs> Set that weight down. Ooh. Grab yourselves those lighter weights. We're gonna hold them right overhead and we're gonna hit, not quit, some little leg flutters here. Ooh. I like that you got that. I got it. Good, now, if this is too much, bend those knees and give me some good old fashioned, not bicycles, but tap those heels. There it is. Just like that. Good. Now, can you keep the small of your back on the mat the whole time? That's this little part right here, right? Can you keep that on the mat while hitting those flutters and getting those shoulder blades up? All Isn't it amazing what a little weight overhead does? Yeah. I can't talk. <laughs> He's like, don't ask me anything. I wanted to talk the whole time, but now just shut up. Shut up, just shut up, shut up. <laughs> Come on, we're almost there. Come on, you got this. Dig a little bit deeper. Everybody loves some ab work and congratulations. We're standing it back up. Okay. Let that sweat be earned. Let it be real, baby. Mm -hmm. Drive those hips back. Give me that hinge. Palms are facing the sky and we're going into a good old fashioned reverse grip fly. How's that feel? That's cool. <laughs> I can breathe. <laughs> Paris, any comments now? Uh, no. <laughs> good, be sure to give me that nice rotational movement here. Beautiful, I love how Tay dropped the weights if it's feeling like it's a little too much. Sometimes those wider movements can feel really aggressive. Again, I wanna remind us the cue, you're not here, you're here. It makes the world of a difference and you're also at that 45 degree hinge and your neck is nice and even. So you're looking out just a little bit in front of you. We are almost there. I know. How you doing everybody? I feel it in my shoulders. Yeah. <laughs> yes. The front and the back. <laughs> oh God. <laughs> my booty shaking from left to right. No, 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 right? <laughs> Set those weights down. Did somebody say they wanted to sweat some more? Yeah. You're welcome. Here Where's we go. Me? Lateral ball slams. Here, oh wow, pair, you, yes, everybody. Yes, 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 yes. Come on, you got this. Now, the more that you really envision slamming that ball, the more challenging this is gonna feel, right? So the more that you mean it, right? This is the time to really let it all out. I always say we store things in our bodies. When we get the ability to really do these moves, please let it all out. Whatever you're holding on to right now, this is your moment to seriously set it free. Come on, three, come on, two, you got this. Two, okay, yeah, and one. Come on, <laughs> we got this. <laughs> Ooh, bring in the heat, baby, today. Don't Grab me. those heavier weights, because we got more to serve. You got more platters to have. I don't know what that meant, but it meant something in my mind. <laughs> Here we go. Stability, single leg deadlift, or full on single leg deadlift, right? Into that good old fashioned curl. Now, if you need to grab, oh, find it, feel it, love it, do it. <laughs> if you wobble or sway, first of all, that is totally okay. We're only human. Find that focal point, give me a slight bend in that stabilizing leg. Good, you're almost there. If you need to tap it down in between, you can. And if you're looking to get really crazy, you can even go ahead and give me that, see what I did there, that high knee. Whoo, almost there, good. And go ahead and switch sides. Good, unload that weight down, slight bend. And again, if you wanna hit that high knee, you can unload that weight down to the mat. Good, we gotta keep that even as we can in the body. Inhale through the nose, exhale it out. Give me that good old fashioned bicep curl in between. Good, find that pendulum, right? Those weights go down, that back leg goes up. Paris, how you doing back there? Yeah. Good. Trying to Whoop. focus. <laughs> yeah, me too, I literally spoke to you and I was like, oh, wobble baby, wobble. <laughs> Last one. Come on, you got this. Give me that nice curl, and there it is. You can either set those weights down or hold them, because we're taking a bow, baby. And by bow, 
I mean, it's time to curtsy lunge. <laughs> so we're right here, right? Take that first foot, step it all the way back. We're gonna hit that sumo in between and then up and over to the other side. Beautiful squeeze those shoulder blades down and back. Ooh, yes. How's everybody doing over here? Good. Yeah? Good, are those legs burning? Yes. Oh, they should be. Burn, baby, burn. Yes, that's right. <laughs> Our bodies are disco inferno right now. <laughs> Good. Feet are facing forwards, right? I want you to imagine there's enough space between that front foot and that back knee. Can you add a pulse? Come on, come on, come on, Paris. Okay. Oh, okay. All right. There it is. Here we go. Give me that pulse. Wow. You're almost there. You have just a few seconds left. Can you hit one more on each side? You're almost there. All the way down. And wow. Set those weights down. And go ahead. Yeah, baby. Hey, Tay. You got this. You got this, got baby. Got We're down on the mat. All right because we got some mountain climbers. It wouldn't be a hit workout without some mountain climbers. So here we are, hands right under those shoulder blades. You got this, everybody. Give me that opposite knee to opposite elbow. The more that you drive those knees up and across, the more that you feel, baby. Yeah. And you signed on to sweat. So we sweating dirty. Instead of riding dirty, we're sweating dirty right now. Come on, keep those shoulders right under those hands. I know right now you want to be here. I want you right here. All right, get that core working. Get those shoulder blades burning. And we are working the whole body in this move. Slow it down just a little bit if you need to. Three, come on. Two, you got this. Don't you give up on me. Not here, not now. Wow, set those knees down. Stand it on up. I'm earning some sweat here. Damn, it feels good. Mm -hmm. Grab those light weights. We're right here. We're going up overhead with them, right? And meeting them underneath those knees. Now, your shoulders are probably on fire right now. Am I right? Definitely. Yes. <laughs> Everything's all right. Right? I like to say <laughs> it's uh, every, everything hurts, right? <laughs> what was it in like middle school? Never mind, let's not even go there. Um, but but <laughs> the shoulders are on fire. I always like to say it's always shoulder season, right? Whether it's summer, whether it's winter, you're always somehow in that tank top, right? Once you get inside, even if it's cold out, yeah. it's always shoulder season. So I just want you to remember that right now. I love when sexy you're like, shoulders. Right? Mm, yes. So you like to show the shoulders off. And guess what? You only have one more, just oh. like that. Wow. Meet me on the mat, baby. You got this, everybody. All the sweat is here. Go ahead, wipe that sweat off right here. We are back in that glute bridge, okay? But the difference this time is that we're adding, we're doing a fly, right? And we're adding a glute bridge march, right? So we're here. Those knees are coming up. Good. What's a good modification for this? I love that question. Go ahead and just hold that glute bridge for me again, Tay. Good. But I still want you to do that fly movement, right? You know, women in particular, we really lack upper body strength. So it's really important that you do push your limits with that upper body movement, right? It's always, I think it's after like the age of 30, we start losing our muscle mass. Isn't that crazy? Every single year. So if you're at home right now, and you're like, ah, oh, my upper body's fine. Guess what? It's time to dig a little bit deeper. It's time to do the dirty work for that upper body work because it will be worth it in the end. But guess what? You're almost there. Imagine hugging that tree. Last one. Wow, set that booty down. Set those weights down and get on up with me. Come on, you got this. You asked for that hip sweat and that's what we're doing. We're gonna hop over. Give me that nice little hop to the side. And here we go. For the modification, you can step and give me that high knee, or you could just step it side to side, right? And if not, if you're looking to push just a little bit more, right? If you're earning to earn that little sweat droplet right there, push yourself just a little bit harder right now because you are so close to that finish line, right? So go ahead, stick with me here. And that change really is happening 
in that body, those endorphins, the serotonin is real. We got time for one more. Wow, Woo. we're not done yet. Not quite yet, baby. Wipe that sweat off, because we got some good old fashioned, I hate to say this, but some man eaters. I didn't make that name up. That's just what they're <laughs> called. So we're here. We're gonna jump it back, forwards. Get those weights up and drive them to the sky. The modification here, step it back, stand it up. You can either press those weights up or have no weight at all. And if you need to modify again, grab those lighter weights, wherever you're at, whatever you do. I trust that you are pushing yourself here. I trust you are digging a little bit deeper. We don't want any injury. So when you hit that plank jump back, I really want you to focus on squeezing those glutes, that booty ooty ooty, right? To keep that nice strong plank. We don't want anyone to hurt themselves. If the weight is feeling like it's too much into that press, go ahead, drop those weights. I go back to the whole idea of core galore. We only have time for one more. Y'all are like, thank you, baby Jesus. <laughs> Set those weights down. Wow. Everybody got real quiet there. I don't know why. I don't know what's happening. No idea. We're on the mat. Congratulations. Because we have a boat up, meeting them in the middle, and you were in the final move of the day. Which means, first of all, that happened real fast. It did. It did, right? Kind of. It really kind of. <laughs> Let's be honest, kind of. <laughs> Meet those weights in the middle. Squeeze those shoulder blades down and back. Inhale through the nose. Exhale out wherever you're at. You're still moving with me. And you only have about 10 more seconds. I love that modification, Tay. Good, still giving me those opening and closings. Good, the wider you go with that movement, the more that you feel, right? The more space you take up, the more challenging it is to move. We got time for one more. And just like that, ladies and gentlemen, you've made it into the cool down. You did it. Woo! I don't know about you all, but I feel pretty good right now. I feel great. I gotta wipe a little sweat off. <laughs> hey, Energy. we're not done yet though. Okay, okay. Right? What are we doing? Everything that we just did by tightening the body, we're right here in a nice little yogi prayer, driving those knees out, right? It's so important that we elongate that body again. So reach up high to the sky with that first arm. Again, releasing all those toxins and that nice transverse twist. Let's go both hands down to the ground. A quick little hip drive to the sky. Oh, how good does that feel? Nice big inhale through the nose all the way down into the diaphragm. Exhale it out, drop those hips back down to the ground. Take that other arm, reach up high to the sky, wow, that feels so good. If everyone could take a little more time at home to continue stretching, maybe you wanna treat yourself to an Epsom salt bath later today, that sounds real nice right now. But I just wanna say thank you, both hands down to the ground, right here again at Heart Center. Thank you everyone so much for being here. I'm Jenna Willis, I hope you enjoyed Class Fit Sugar and be sure to check out a ton of the other workouts on the platform. Bye-bye. I gotta wipe this sweat off. <laughs> <Woo>. <laughs>